You've probably heard the saying, teamwork makes the dream work, but often team projects can be a real nightmare. You're wrong! Why am I wrong? I don't know, but you're always just stupid. I don't like it. No, no, you're right. Wow, those people are really dumb. I'm just gonna sit here and watch them. <laughs> <laughs> now imagine this scenario in real life. This is dysfunctional airline flight 999 requesting to descend at 15,000 feet. But Captain, that mountain is 20,000 feet. No, it's 15,000 feet. Flight engineer, do you concur? That's not my job. But sir, we can't descend. My plane. No, it's my plane. 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 Well, maybe we exaggerate a bit, but in the real world, you'll be expected to work on a team. Teams that are diverse, people with different skills, abilities, and opinions. In school, team projects are common. We learn math, science, and history. But do we really learn how to be a team? At the beginning of the project, a good team will decide a common goal and what they need to get the job done. When everyone shares ideas to create something amazing, it's called collaboration. Although there is no I in team, ask yourself, what could I do to be a better team player? First, don't be intimidated. You need to share your ideas. Listen to other team members' ideas and never interrupt. Respect their opinions. Recognize other skills and abilities. Always do your share of the workload and never let your teammates down because you're not responsible. With a little work, you can go from a nightmare to a dream team. This is Dream Team Airlines, Flight 999, requesting to descend at 15,000 feet. But Captain, that mountain is 20,000 feet. Flight Engineer, do you concur? Yes, I concur. It's 20,000 feet. Thank you. Flight 999, maintaining altitude. Great work, team. If you want your career to soar, start practicing good teamwork today. On the road to success, I'm Olivia, and you've got this. We're flying! Guys, we're flying!